my travels around the world is what caused me to get involved, and I've seen hunger all over the world. And I want to address the issue right here at home, in our own backyard here in Buffalo, New York. I mean, you know, I've seen people taking a choice between paying a light bill, a gas bill, and something to eat. And we had to do something about that, without a doubt. We had to make a change somehow. I got involved with uh, Ron Daniels from the American Federation of Musicians, brought in the Buffalo to call the fame. Susan Marie, Michael Taylor May Jazz, Lance Diamond, we all met, decided let's go to work, let's make a change, let's make a difference. Music was the universal language at this important benefit concert. The night kicked off with the barroom buzzards in the lobby of Klein Hands. We're here for a very special evening. On the big stage, News 4's Joe Arena introduced a night of music that suits everyone's taste. Musicians from across Western New York donated their talents to this concert from the heart. The recipients of their generosity are people served by the Food Bank of Western New York and the Buffalo City Mission, where 200,000 meals are served a year. People have needs, and we're doing it. We're doing it uh, on a consistent basis. But there's so many people that are suffering much worse than any of us, so we have to find a way that we can just give a little bit to help others. The concert was made possible because everybody pitched in, also because of the huge turnout of supporters. Kind of makes you rooted and grounded to understand that you need to be thankful for what you're able to do and reaching out and maybe uh, affecting those that maybe not have the same thing that you have. Lisa Flynn, News 4 at 11. You know, there was an international uh, touch to all of this as well because the BBC was there conducting interviews with some of the musicians. So it's a great Well, night. they got an yeah. earful, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, they did. Indeed. Time now, six minutes to eight GMT. And times are tough in the U.S. as the recession bites ever deeper. And one of the surest signs of this can be found in the lengthening queues for free food handouts in the major cities. Buffalo in New York State is a case in point. And to help fund the local food bank, there's just been a highly unusual musical collaboration, a fundraising concert involving the Buffalo Philharmonic Orchestra, joining forces with a group of much less formal jazz artists. I've been speaking to Michael Billany from the Food Bank of Western New York and to George Scott, leader of the George Scott Big Band and president of the Historic Coloured Musicians Club. Food banks across the country have seen a 30% increase in the request for food from its agencies from a year ago. In Los Angeles, the need is 40% greater and it's above average in Houston, Orlando, and other cities that have had great number of home foreclosures. Here in Buffalo, New York, we're a little bit behind that, and our need from our member agencies is only up 11% from last year. And so these are people who use your services who have simply dropped through the bottom of uh, all safety nets. We are finding a whole new breed of clientele, and that is the working poor. We're either the...